so Karen, I know that uh, uh, Google is pretty much uh, preaching the multi-cloud strategy in its uh, relationship with uh, uh, environments which are already there at, on customer side. Uh, can you a little bit? Uh, can you unwrap a little bit? How does it work for 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 the business? For instance, if I'm already doing something with with Azure or AWS, how can I uh, sort of try things with with GCP in, in that instance? Yeah. So definitely, the multi-cloud hybrid cloud narrative is really really strong within Google. So you might have heard of um, some of our open source offerings like Kubernetes. So we believe in open source and. That technology that was created within Google, which is now open source, um, that's actually been transformed now in EKS in the form of AWS uh, as AKS in, in Azure. So all of these different environments actually embody and use Kubernetes containerized technologies. And what we actually announced last year was a service called Anthos. So that was released. And essentially, that is a single pane of glass that allows you to manage infrastructure across public cloud, private cloud, on-premise bare metal environments. So no matter if you have an existing on-premise footprint, you have some bare metal, you have you're using a different public cloud or private cloud, there are ways and methods to actually have a single view of all of those services. And that's actually throughout our Anthos technology. But in the sense of multi-cloud, we're seeing more and more that you know people are adopting the best of breeds. So they might use infrastructure with one cloud provider, they might have security networking with another, and they might have the data warehouse um, and machine learning capabilities with another. So it's allowing this ability to be able to pick and choose which services to use, use from each. And from a Google Cloud standpoint, we're very open to, to multi-cloud and hybrid cloud. Yeah, fantastic.